Hello, welcome to module three. We will be doing uh, peer reviews this week, and it's uh, I know it's uh, deceptive looks deceptively light this week, but it's actually going to be a little uh, a lot of work. So um, pay close attention um, when you do the peer reviews, and uh, I look forward to to reading them. Very good, Brian. Hello, I want to welcome you to the module three of the lecture okay. part. Uh, before I go into detail, I want to show you, you will see that these posters is, are the, the poster of our new building the, the called BIT Building, the Business and Information Technology. Although you are studying online, but uh, this is your building also. We'll have a whole wing of e-learning studio. Uh, if you happen to have time to come on campus uh, after May 31st next year, uh, we will be living in that building. So module three for the lecture part, there are a few things. You want to, uh, the first thing you want to look into, exam the uh, time management, all the skills, and I want you to look at your weekly uh, schedule and give us a very precise plan for your weekly. Uh, and we want to make sure that you allocate enough time for your study and also kind of force you to have the discipline to manage your own time. The bigger part for this week is, is a two-week process. We want you to, uh, as an individual and also as a team, to look into what is the field of computer science? What are the essential knowledge you have to have? And also look at our curriculum and, and do the research yourself to look at what each course are about and write a paragraph uh, from your team's uh, uh, decision on how the, our curriculum is going to cover all the fields. And I want to, in your own words, in your team's own words, uh, what are each field about and why should we learn it in our computer science major? Uh, towards the end of the, the week and definitely next week, you are going to make appointment with Claudia and look at all the schedule of each uh, course and also uh, what other classes like prerequisite or GE you need to take. So at the end of next module, you should have a very clear picture of what class you take in this program, what other GE and uh, also prerequisite class you need to take from other campuses. And uh, finally, at the end of next week, I have to give you a little bit more preview, is that when you finalize ILP, you also need to determine your educational goal in this program. Uh, and also your long-term career goal. Then as a faculty, we'll know how to help you a little bit more beyond our set curriculum. Okay, that's the uh, module three, and enjoy it.